Hi guys, Del here, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Alpha First Aid Kit refill that you can purchase. I've already showed you a quick overview on this pack. Some people liked it, some people didn't, but it's excellent value for money. So I'm going to show you the refill pack for this, which is everything bar the pouch, and let you decide on that. It varies from £19 on their site to £25 on Amazon, so it's a cracking buy um, if you just want to add it to your glove box or add it to your own pouches without actually having to buy this pouch. So let's take a closer look at that. So here we have the Alpha First Aid Kit that I've done an overview on. Um, that's it complete with the pouch. Brilliant kit for the price. £35 that was coming in at. So we're going to take a look at the refill. The refill comes as is, I'm going to show you everything that's in that. On the site it's on sale at £19, um, you can pick it up on Amazon, I think it's for £25. So let's take a closer look at what's actually in this pack. Um, it lets you see what you actually do get. So it's basically everything that was in the pack, in the pouch itself, um, and we'll just have a little closer look. Ideally, if you've got your own pouches, um, this would be a, a great addition to get, or even for a glove box kit. For those that you are advanced first aid trained, you will add and change things out in this. So, the first little packet, do it's all sorts of sterile suture strips and dressings, the sterile pads, as you can see, plenty of adhesive wound dressings alcohol wipes, swabs, and lots of different types of plasters knuckle plasters, finger plasters, large plasters, small strip plasters there's a great varied amount there take you quite a while to get through all that if you're accident prone so that's the first pack the second pack nice resealable plastic bags, I like these the zip bags in this one, as you can see We've got different bandage dressings. So, green dressings in different sizes 18 by 8 centimeters, 12 by 12 centimeters, and then um, a smaller iPad. Again, smaller dressing. A good, varied amount there. We've also got a stretch bandage. You'll have seen these for sprains and strains and slings. These are really good for putting over your wound dressings too, and the tape. Tape's really good, I use this a lot. I tend to get a lot of hacks and a lot of cuts on my fingers just from my job, so I, I tend to uh, tape them up a lot, and I use that an awful lot. Great bit of kit. What I like about this is, it is everything apart from the pouch. So it's extremely good value. We get a guide inside, emergency guide for adults, children and babies. Prompts are always brilliant to have. You won't always remember everything that's going down at the time you're treating. These are brilliant prompt cards. So that's a great little guide there to aid you. The gloves, these come in it too. Vinyl powder free, medium gloves. Now check, always check the sizes of gloves when you first get a kit, you will change them out. I've ordered all. I change all mine out to extra large um, on my on my hands, which I which I buy from um, Saint John's. Um, you get them in packets, and they they come in packets of two for about a pound fifty. So I change all mine out to those. But these are medium, so I'll keep these for the daughter or something like that. Triangular bandage for making your slings. Um, so th these these are good just for slinging. Um, broken limbs things like that if you haven't got a splint the velcro badge i thought this was really good you wouldn't expect that in there but it is and the limitless equipment badge that comes in the pack as well so if you're adding it to your own you've got a badge you can put on it good quality shears i don't know if you can hear that sometimes you get them in the really flimsy uh, you've got to watch for the quality of these shears these are tough and robust. I like these. I like the quality of them. They don't bend like a tin can. As you can see that, that's about two and a half mil thick. So they're really good. Good quality. Zip ties. 
They're good for the plastic bags, things like that, putting around uh, different dressings. Don't forget, this was made from a survival company too, so it has elements in it that you would need. The whistle. Nice and loud, like that. Safety pins with it too. You can attach that to your clothing if need be. Tweezers, quite often overlooked. They're there. A rebreather mask. I carry lots of these. You can pick them up free from the Red Cross and things like St Andrews and places like that, St John's. Um, but I carry a lot of those. They're good to have. Different size safety pins, always good. Um, I've given safety pins at my first aid kit to members of my family um, when we've been at weddings and christenings and things like that and they've maybe had a wee wardrobe malfunction. They're always handy for other things other than first aid. Handy survival blanket. I'm going to do a video on this. Loads of different uses for survival blankets as well as insulation purposes. You can make water carriers, um, fishing lures, everything out of these. I'll do a video on that to show you that. Notepad and pen, uh, pencil, again excellent, limitless equipment, swap it out for a sharpie if you like, it's got your map skill, your ruler and everything on the side there, your spray mist bottle, put whatever you choose in that, water works fine, antiseptic, anything like that, something that nobody's going to react to, and then your rat tourniquet. I will do a video on this. I've done a new video on another other tourniquets, the cat ones. So that's an example of what is in that kit. It's not an example, it is what is in that kit. It's a great refill um, for, for your kits, it be it even if it is in the Alpha kit pouch or not. For the money, it's well worth it. Go and buy it. What else could you add to it? You could add Siloom stick and a compression bandage. You could change out the rat for a cat. Um, all sorts of things like that. But personally I think it's a pretty good basic IFAT kit. Um, I like it a lot. Gets a big thumbs up from me. Refill's a great price. You're saving what, £15 um, compared to buying it with the pouch itself. So nothing really stopping you from buying it. Um, it's good. Could you buy it cheaper? I don't really think so. I think once you buy all the kit that's in it and we're to add it, I don't think you could buy it cheaper individually. I just like it. I think it's a good I think it's a good kit. It's well thought out and um, it's handy for your glove box, vehicle, backpacking, anything like that. You can add different things to it, burn treatments and stuff like that, but if you're if you're first aid trained then you'll know what you want to add for your own um, experience so thanks for watching everyone stay safe out there prepadel out